Previously, with Rob and Sherry, they take you to Lake Powell to enjoy high-performance boats, which were a kick to watch. Later, they let Cinder do some swimming in the lake, and then they conquer fixing the air conditioning. Then Rob learns how to pump out the marine toilet. In this episode, Rob and Sherry take you up to Lake Powell for four days. At the end of those four days, bring the boat back down to Arizona to regroup. Hi guys, we're both here hanging out at the boat and I thought we'd save you from sitting in the car telling you what's going on. We just drove the page. We're up in uh, Lake Powell and we're in the boat as you can see. Mm -hmm. And uh, we slept in really, <laughs> we sleep good in here. <laughs> so. We're up here for, for four days, I think it is. Yeah, yep, four, four days. So four days, three nights. No. Nope. Three nights. No. <laughs> three days, four nights. <laughs> yeah, three days, four nights. Anyway, so we're just kind of goofing off. We're uh, actually on a mission. We're going to, we brought the trailer up, so we didn't show you hooking that up because it was nighttime anyway. And uh, we're going to pull the boat out of the lake and take it down to Phoenix, down by where we live. And, uh, uh, install some new equipment and systems on the boat that we want to put in and then we are thinking about putting the boat in Lake Pleasant which is only 50 miles away from where we live now which make it make it kind of nice huh so uh Cinder Cinder, Cinder just went swimming <laughs> so she'd be a dork <laughs> anyway and she's a happy dog happy. huh happy dog happy 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 so anyway, that's what we're doing. Um, we'll try to. We're gonna try to take the boat out a few times. We're just gonna relax, let you enjoy what we see. Uh, it is uh, the month of October, so uh, it's still warm. It's actually quite warm, and uh, very happy dog. So that's what we're doing. Hang in there, and we'll see what we come up with. We're also gonna go into town and uh, take some pictures there too. So talk to you later. Bye. Say bye. Bye. So it's a beautiful day today. Decided to let you see what's outside here. And uh, i just show you around a little bit. So we're gonna grab the dog. We're gonna go all the way, I think I ran it, all the way up in that hillside up there and get the truck. And then we're gonna go on the page. And uh, there's another marina that we're gonna go see. And we thought we'd show you that and then see what else we come up with. And we gotta get some groceries and just dawdle around. So I thought I'd show you real quick where we're parked at. Um, we're uh, got a nice little space here. Of course, every boat around this is bigger. That's just how it works out. You know, if you ever buy an RV, somebody always buys a bigger one and a newer one. So anyway, but we're happy with it. Really nice place. You see all the boats down here. <coughs> And for October, it's fairly busy. Yeah. People are still enjoying the lake. It's still 80 degrees. Nice so, day. Nice day. So we took a little drive uh, past Page to another marina called Antelope Point Marina. And we just showed you around here. Uh, a lot smaller than the marina we're at. But, uh, uh, well, they got them packed in tight over there. It's a nice facility. I think I like, I think I like my marina better. So guys, we were just in Page, drove all around, we showed you some pictures and stuff, and uh, we went to the grocery store, so now you get to see the process of what we have to go through to get groceries down to the boat way down there. So behind me is some carts. We get the loaded cart, and then we got to take all of our groceries down to the boat. <coughs> now I get to load it.
This is as good as going to Costco. Maybe a bigger boat. What? <sighs> this? Yum. Spiced rum. Yum, yum. Now what we have to do is uh, park the truck. Then I meet Sherry back here, and then we wheel it all the way back down there. Alrighty, time to park the truck. Here we go. like somebody in a cart decided that they're going to do our groceries with us so we're going to take our groceries down with a cart Woohoo! that'd be easier that's cheating you know so i make this big spill on this on our channel about how we got to carry our stuff all the way down on the boat and then you bring a cart up uh -huh. like, Woo -hoo. <laughs> Hi, Cinder. all right we're going on the cart so we just unloaded here the guy's being nice enough to get us a cart Nice kid. We gotta make sure, always make sure you tip these guys. Yeah, this taking groceries is tough. Well, the trick is, let your wife do it. Now, you guys, I did the grocery shopping. Sherry stayed in the car, so. Oh. Because we had Cinder with us, we couldn't take her in the grocery store, so. But uh, that's why she's pulling in the cart. The pull her weight, man. Oh, sorry, baby. And of course, the last thing you do is when you're done with all this stuff, you gotta take the cart back. So, Sherry's gonna take it back because she needs to use the restroom, so it worked out. But I get to put away groceries. So, there's all of our groceries. Now to find a place to put it all. Now that the boat's all supplied and ready to go, stay tuned for the next episode when Rob and Sherry take you around Antelope Island. It's a three hour cruise with spectacular views. Thank you for watching our videos. Please take the time to subscribe and consider being a Patreon supporter. There is many more adventures and some big surprises coming in the future with your help. Thanks again.